Hello everyone, my name is Katarina from Garden Design Tools. Today we're going to talk about uh, the newest release um, version of Lumion, uh, Lumion uh, 9.5 Pro, okay? And we're going to see a little bit um, some of the new items they add to their library, uh, some of the new material textures, especially regarding all that help us as garden designers or landscape architects, okay, or landscapers, anyone that's uh, using Lumion to create garden design projects or landscaping projects, okay? So that's my main focus in this video and all my other videos actually. So this is a, um, a model uh, uh, I'm working on for a client actually. Um, this is not new. Everyone that follows me on Instagram knows already this model quite well because I'm posting loads of images. Um, but I just wanted to quickly show some of the, the release uh, textures, uh, materials, especially the wood uh, ones um, that are, are quite interesting. So. If you go to materials, we just go to the outdoor wood material and all these ones. So this one, it was not, but you had, you have quite, a, you had only two polygon before two or three, and now you have quite a few more. Okay. So as you can see here, all these are new ones. Okay. All this are new um, and polygon, as you know, it's a really good quality textures. Okay. And you can have access in their website as well to these textures. So even if you want to, um, to download their normal map of the texture, anything like this, you can, you can go and download it and still improve here on Lumion. Okay. Because if you double click, you still have a, quite a, a lot of settings here. Uh, I always add a bit of weathering as well. Okay, don't forget to put on wood and a little bit of wet. Don't go all the way up, but I like to weather it a little bit and uh, the edges as well. But yeah, we have quite a few uh, different wooden textures. So I'm just going to, I'm going to add to the blog post after um, the release notes from Lumion, but they actually add in total in, in terms of textures, uh, three uh, fine wood uh, for interiors and exteriors, uh, two wood materials for cabin walls, so this more interior stuff, uh, 16 wood floors, and nine types of wood uh, planks, and uh, four types of worn wood planks, and after uh, brick uh, materials, medieval, medieval bricks, and two type of uh, diamond steel floors and one fabric of wicker material. Wicker, pretty cool for exterior as well, okay? So the, the only thing I have to say about Lumion when they, they release uh, materials is because they is not in order here. So you have to discover um, where are they? Okay, so in here in wood, you can see the polygon one are the new ones, okay? In here in brick, um, okay, you'll check it out, it, it should be a, the polygon one as well. So it might be one of these ones, but um, because I don't actually use a lot of brick, we don't use a lot of brick like this in Portugal, so that I don't use them a lot in my projects. Um, Some stone work looks really good. So yeah, so you just have to find them out because they're all mixed. Okay, that's what I was trying to say. Um, I'm I'm liking this. I'm liking this wooden flooring here. It's pretty cool. Don't forget, you can always just you know, if you press Shift and just hover with the mouse, you go slower. Okay, if I don't press shift, it goes pretty quick. Just, I just wanted to show you quickly. It looks pretty good. Yeah, that looks good. 
as you can see the more good quality textures you use the better um, improves a lot your your final images okay and what improves a lot as well i i find that is the 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 weathering a little bit okay just weather it a little bit i like it it's a bit just a tiny bit more realistic in your images okay so let's check out now the objects um so mainly uh, as a garden designer um the main news is that they have some uh new um, trunks tree trunks what I would love to have is for example if you have this what I would love to have Lumion in the future but this is my my dream is if if you had here for example you have this tree selected is having here an option of the seasons the different seasons of that tree and it automatically has that uh, tree in different seasons so I can quickly go from this bachelor in the winter this bachelor in the summer this bachelor in the spring so this is my dream right now they don't have that of course uh, this is a quite a complex um, uh, thing to have in inside the Lumion library but they had they, they had these leafless trees so if you as you can see in the nature library they have these new tabs leafless trees and the forest wood so the forest wood let's go to that one first it's just some you know uh, pieces of wood it's actually it's a bit to create a scenario you know if you if you if you think about it okay so you have all these bits of wood that you can add to your if you think something more natural or something like you need these string trunks you could add this from sketchup 3d warehouse for example but now you have it here okay so you have these logs so you have quite a few this and this is all new okay stumps okay so as you can see you can really create a scenario a forest scenario something like this this is a twig it's a different kind of twig so you have quite a lot mm, I'm not sure if you're gonna use this a lot or not uh, because um, there is just a few uh, situations I wanted to create a scenario like this you know just to create the ambience of a project but normally I'm not gonna use this okay but uh, this is a whole new tab they add as you can see there is a lot of things they had here and the other one is leafless trees okay so they had this leafless shrub it might be good if you want to just demonstrate how is the shrub in the winter or something like this to your client okay let's just starting erasing some things here okay um, and you have they don't say the specific tree it is this is just say uh, leafless tree let's see what's this so you have a few different there's a willow here So as you can see, it's a good idea if you want to demonstrate how it's going to look in the winter or, you know, if you have the time that sometimes the ideal will be to do some renderings, spring and uh, autumn renderings. Okay, and if you have the time, if it's a big project, definitely do it. And with this, it helps you. You don't have a lot, as you can see, um, 14 now yeah 14 uh, but uh, you know you the other ones you don't have you can probably get them in the 3d warehouse in sketchup uh, but yeah it's just a, a nice little uh, feature um, it's new I like that they're always improving so that's a really good thing in Lumion and um, I was happy with it uh, especially for as a garden designer the more we have in the library the better the better 
Uh, but yeah, the rest is more interior uh, stuff. I'm gonna add all the release notes in the in the in the post and in the description of this video. Okay, so that's basically it. Not much more to add. Um, look how it went. It's pretty cool the deck. I think it's really nice. Okay, so don't forget we're gonna do in in this summer we're gonna have uh, um, animation, so animation intensive uh, course. So we have the normal uh, Lumion course, um, but uh, for someone that wants to go in into deep animation, we're gonna have a, a, a new uh, shorter course in just in animation inside Lumion. Um, and yeah, if you wanna check out our courses, we're gonna have the. Uh, we have SketchUp basics for garden designers and the Lumion one, as you can see. And uh, soon we're going to have a, a new uh, updated version. Uh, it's going to be on top of this one, in for the SketchUp one. Okay, so if you purchase it now, when the new version is going to come up, the price is going to come up. Okay, uh, so if you purchase now, you're going to still have access to the new version. Okay, so we're going to update all the course. Okay, and uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you guys. See you next time.